Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the Windows security error message that when you attempt to enter in your network credentials, it says that the username or password is incorrect. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I would recommend doing, make sure you have the correct spelling and character usage in your username and password. It sounds pretty obvious, but you never know when you accidentally upper or lower case the wrong letters. It's certainly a possibility of why you're unable to connect successfully. Something else we can try here as well, if we were to open up the search menu, type in control panel, best match, or come back with control panel, go ahead and open that up. Set your view by to large icons, and then you want to select network and sharing center. Select change advanced sharing settings. Expand the all network option. And where it says password protected sharing, you want to go ahead and toggle that to the off position to see if that resolves the problem. So close out of here. And then attempt to connect back to that network location and see if that works. If you're still having a problem, something else we can try, close out of here. Open up local security policy, best match, or come back with local security policy. So go ahead and open that up. And now select the local policies on the left side, so double click on that. And then left click on security options. On the right side, locate where it says accounts limit local accounts use a blank password to console login only. You want to go ahead and double click on that. Make sure that's set to enabled and then select apply and OK. And then one final thing, you close out of here. Open up the search menu. Type in settings, best match, or come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. Select network and internet on the left panel. And then on the right side, you want to scroll down and select advanced network settings. And then underneath more settings, you want to select network reset, reset all network adapters to factory settings. So this will remove and then reinstall all of your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards, such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. Go ahead and select the Reset Now button. Before you select Yes, make sure you have your Wi-Fi credentials nearby because once you select Yes and you restart your computer, you will need to enter those back in to get back online. So with that in mind, select Yes. And now you can close out of here. And I would suggest restarting your computer at this time. Okay, there you go, guys. And then hopefully at this point, guys, your issues should have been resolved. So, as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.